the Oklahoma County Jail, they have two Intoxilizer 8000s they use for DUI suspects. But yesterday's ruling brings up some questions. Basically, every intoxilizer test given on the Intoxilizer 8000 for the last several years is invalid. It all stems from one 2013 DUI case, but could impact thousands more. That DUI offender's attorney claimed rules were broken, and items used to administer the test were simply chosen by the director of the Oklahoma Board of Tests for Alcohol and Drug Influence. The problem, those decisions are supposed to go through a legislative process. It was a technicality in the rules that's been in existence for a very long time. Kevin Barons with the BOT says there was no finding that the test is not reliable. But since rules were broken, this particular test was inadmissible. DUI attorney John Hunsucker says this means the tests used in 10 to 20,000 other DUI cases similar to this are inadmissible too. I have 400 cases downstairs in a file cabinet awaiting this decision. Those people should be getting their licenses back now. In Oklahoma City, Crystal Price, KOCO 5 News.